Robinson played Reanimator, <laughs> KB played Delver. Alright, I'm, I'm out of here. Us mess with chat? We would... We would never... We would never do anything to mess with chat. I don't... I don't know what Dan's talking about. Imagine tricks. We'll uh, we'll get right on that. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, right there. You you might gotta look for a gem in the rough. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. We should roll some die. <laughs> what you got? Uh, a pair of fours. Got a uh, pair I got a pair of twos. I'll be on the draw. <laughs> Sounds huh. good. True Nemesis is better than Merktide, change your mind. Have you ever hit your opponent for eight with a True Nemesis? <laughs> you ever cast True Nemesis for two? I'm keeping seven. Also going to keep seven. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. You're at twenty life. Within zero gallons. Ask me? Yeah. I want to do the more. What do I, what do I know is in your hand again? Waste ponder. Actually, this probably just puts you on zero. Even though it feels kind of weird in the surface. Lose eight. Um, trigger game three. Go. Uh, true chance of all game to your opinion after the game. Keep those three. Yep. 
that. Combat? Mm hmm. Trigger. No blocks. Discard right now, XL. Yeah, just discard. Okay. Good. He's on an adventure. Go ahead. These have a bolt in hand. Yep. Go ahead. Can't protect what's on the top of your deck. I pondered and left it too. Yeah. It's not a good one to draw. <clears throat> yep. This is gonna be plus three. Go ahead. that line thinking just like well if I miss on this grizzle brand maybe we get burned out the ponder uh, showed me the broad bar where I was like Phew. <laughs> thank god it's the only hat we have also that also that looting was stinky yeah and then what a pro Actually, might have avoided dying there. I, I think I had the option to hard cast the grief, which would have just kind of beat slowly beaten you to death. Then, Philly with the brainstorm, take the bolt. You're forced to borrow her. Um, yeah. I also was supposed to keep the. Well, if that's better or worse. Yeah, I think I keep the. So I. So my, my ponder was Waste, Borrower, Merc, and I think I could have kept the Merc on top, drawn that to the Wasteland, and then I discard the Bolt to the Archon, and then your choice would have been between Brainstorm and Merc, uh, which is a harder choice. But that's a more live draw than, than Wasteland. Why did I ditch the Entomb off the Faithless Living? Well, honestly, without any more mana source, I really wasn't sure what I would be, want to be Entombing for. Oh, 
Um, I could have hard cast the grief after the looting. I mean, yeah, the outcome's probably still the same. Isn't the outcome probably close to the same where he's just at three? I might get it. I, get, I guess I get an extra draw step if he's forced to bolt one of those. Or if I do hard cast the grief and I say my line is that he uh, has found, found petty theft, then I just take the bolt and make him cantrip. Been a very long day. We are coming up on twenty hours. I guess we're at nineteen hours right now. That's a long time to be awake. I started off the uh, day in a very, very, very different state. <laughs> started off in North Carolina, end up in the pit. Oh wow, that is a very different state. <laughs> A lot of driving. Oh, this is a what? snack mulligan. I'm not even gonna wait for you. <laughs> this was a mana source away from perfection. <laughs> <laughs> Mine was six lands and Dragon's Rage Channeler. <laughs> that. Yeah. That was a Chancellor effect plus the nuts. Just no starter. Chancellor's main in that deck, or do you? Yeah. I think that's where. I think that's where they're supposed to be. Is that the same hand, but worse? No, this is <laughs> this is the, a different hand. Uh. <laughs> I can't keep this. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna, and I'm not super happy with it, but that's okay. I'm gonna bottom this. No one made a request. Come on, deck him something good. So the second, Jeez. so the first hand was minus a mana source. The second hand was good with eluding, except it was scrubland swamp and some garbage. And that that hand just had no way to put a, put a creature in the bin or reanimate it. That had three fatties in it. Damn. You live by the smack, flip your deck into play on turn one, and you die by the flip your deck into. <laughs> Deck into play in turn one. I don't know. I probably should have got Grizz in game one, but I wanted to see how it would go. Apparently, Brazen Borrow is how it went, but, uh. <laughs>
been a real good seven. <laughs> it's hard to complain about it as a four, but uh, yeah. Doesn't matter where we're at, put this on. All right, do it. You're on the play. <laughs> I'm not used to being in this situation. Um, <laughs> looting. Go. Go. <laughs> oh god, you, that, we kept one of these hands. Go. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Don't rip secrets. Yep. Go. <laughs> Go. Trigger Delver. Flip Delver. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it makes you feel any better. I can't cast it. Three. I don't know if that actually changes the way we feel about it. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, deck. Kevin. What did I do? I heard you were talking bad about my card. Talking bad about uh, Oath of Druids? Yeah. I wish our boy Oath of Druids was a little bit more playable still. Uh, man, I think it's, I think it's fine. Uh, well, okay, I think the only build you can play now is Combo Oath, and I'm sad about that. Uh, yeah, maybe. Uh, I have Korean Archons for a reason. Did, did you get, did you buy all of, I can't remember the Japanese woman's name that was doing real well for a while, Oath? That's the Archon Oath list that was floating about? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I just like, uh, I just like the Go list ahead. that has a couple more cones in it. Oh shit, he can, can cast he can it. cast it now. <laughs> it's busted. Uh... Go ahead. So hand, exile, bottom, and then play from exile. Yep. Go ahead. It's time to see how bad it is. Technically something we have available to us. <laughs> I'd like to unmask myself. 
Unmask yourself. <laughs> uh, sure, that's fine. We're gonna reveal. We're gonna be a Sarah's emissary. Okay. You can control protection, which isn't card type. Okay. Attempt to reanimate a Sarah's <laughs> emissary. Do you imagine if that fucking resolved? Uh, we would be at one. I'm going to lightning bolt you in response. <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Who says Lightning Bolt is dead against Reanimator? <laughs> I was counting for a moment there. There was a turn where I had CMC 30 in my hand. <laughs> Boop. Yeah, we, we didn't get to wait any longer. <laughs> How many more forces were in your hand? I had force, I had. Brazen Borrower. I had Force Blue Card, Brazen Borrower, and Surgical Extraction. <laughs> you can reveal your hand at any point in time in the game. <laughs> no, that's me. Say the reason. There's a reason I'm known as F Fair Blue Control Player and not Johnny Combo Player. <laughs> It's I started off as a as a Johnny player, and then uh, I was like, "No, nah, blue decks are better. That I should play blue decks if I can." I, I got oh, the right. I got the brainstorm bug, or actually, I got the death right shaman bug. <laughs> death right shaman's a hell of a drug. However, at the time, you had to fuel it with underground seas. <laughs> In college, me it was just like. Looks like we're playing Miracles, because it plays like one to two duels. <laughs> However, Krakus was a hundred dollar card at the time. Oh, yeah, yeah. Before they reprinted it at all. Somehow Ever. I don't have my original Krakus anymore, and I'm sad about that. Yeah, I'll buy that. I'm gonna get some note for game two is don't wait so long to go for it, but I yeah. was pretty sure I was just really fucked. If you keep the you mold the four. I mold like, the four well, I mold the four and you kept the sanctuary million pieces of interaction hand. Cause I've kept that hand before. I've been on that <laughs> side, I'm like, 